A policy is a group of instructions that control how the Adaptive Identity Services operate. For example, you may have policies for allowing users to add applications to the portal, policies defining authentication rules, policies for user security and permissions, policies for endpoint access, and policies for third-party integration. One policy does not have to control every aspect of the identity service for the users it governs. In fact, it's best practice not to mix and match topics within one policy. A policy can be applied to either all users and devices or by role. You can control different aspects of the identity service for users through their membership in one or more roles and by applying one or more policies to each role. Let's navigate to Core Services, Policies, to view the Policies table. You can see that we've already created a few policies. Policies can potentially include many different details, but it's best practice to target each policy for a specific purpose. The default policy is the basic experience that all users have coming to your Identity Services platform. Let's open it to take a look. On the Policy Settings page, we see some basic information, including the name and description of the policy. And we can see in this case that this policy applies to all users and devices. Let's take a look at the summary to see what's included with this policy. This policy includes some endpoint policy settings, some authentication policy settings for adaptive services, and some user security policies. Let's open authentication policies to the Adaptive Services page to see how the default experience is set up. These are the settings that control how our users sign into the user portal. We'll discuss these in more detail in the Configuring Multi-Factor Authentication course. Now let's return to the Policies table. Remember that each user or role may be subject to many different policies. We can see from our names and descriptions that we have more than one policy that applies for our contractors, controlling different aspects of their adaptive experience. The hierarchy of this policy table is important. Policies apply from top down, so a policy lower on the table will be overridden by policies above when the same setting applies to the same user or role. For example, we might have multiple MFA policies that apply to different roles. But if any user is a member of multiple roles, then whichever policy covering them that is closest to the top of the policies table is the one that governs any overlapping settings.